All right, everyone, Supreme Kami over here. So we are going to be taking a look at the Freedom Gun over here. As you guys can see that the proportion in this right now, uh, it looks so funny, right? Uh, because this is going to be a big scope. So if you guys are going to be planning to use, let's say, uh, the backpack can see ESQ, you guys going to see like a big drastic changes, right? Uh, <laughs> look at this right here. All right, let me give you guys an example. If I equip this to maybe like the like the smaller scale bit, um, let me see. If I filter this by seed, and then let me do horse freedom. If I do this with the regular, you guys can see. I'm just gonna actually do this. Uh, this actually does look really funny. You got like a big head freedom right there, as well as like a big backpack. Look at that. Look at the size of the wing level. Oh my god. Yeah, this this right here does look pretty wonky for sure. Uh, definitely looks like one of those. I don't know, like maybe those um, chibi looking like. So uh, I don't know. Like let me do know like what do you guys like. How how do you guys feel about like having like a big scale if, like as a visual onto like this is gonna be a one to one hundred scale. Uh, and then our regular is those uh, one to one forty four scale. So do let me know like how do you guys feel about. That kind of scale differences do you guys like it or do you guys don't really mind too much about like the overall appearance yeah it does look kind of wonky right there but uh in terms of ex skill that i want to be testing out is uh, definitely going to be uh the backpack over here is going to be the high mass of full birds over here in terms of this ex skill right here i find that if you don't equip to let's say like a freedom like right here if you don't equip that uh, you're not going to get you, you, you will not get the visual of the rail cannon popping up so that is one downside i guess if you don't really have the freedom leg i have not tested out using like maybe the strike video leg maybe that will trigger that but i'm not too sure i didn't really test it out but uh in terms of that the other ESU that i can potentially you know will be testing out it's not really this one uh this is definitely not the big scale version of it uh but in terms of overall animation it's exactly the same uh the only difference is only going to be the effects down right here so in terms of the new one they completely removed the squad uh health recovery um they definitely went for more of like a all out power boosting up to a 49 percent i believe out to alteration so that's that um in terms of the other ex skill uh there's actually not a leg or a shield ex skill so we do have a um, head Vulcan that we can you know just kind of use right um i will have to say that head Vulcan is uh, probably like i would have to say it's probably one of the worst um you know ex skill to be using but you know they do exist uh, so um so that is going to be pretty much it so, uh i would definitely put this onto a custom no to a, a creative mission and just kind of run through some this is going to be uh using multiple times of the custom EX skill and see like what, what could we potentially do right uh definitely want to be trying out the EX skill and just trying to see how it looks like and then you know that should be pretty much a wrap of this video just you know just uh simply want to be using the EX skill for you guys over here and then just kind of see like how they perform in like actual battles and all that so let me actually do put this on my um you know cd reduction build and then we'll jump straight into a creative mission all right, I think I found myself a pretty fitting, you know, creative mission to be taken on. So this is going to be a, a strike creative freedom gauntlet over here. It's created by Misa. Oh, is it, is it Masa over here? If I am pronouncing your name wrong, please forgive me. But uh, this is probably one of the more fitting ones to be looking at uh, because I'm using a freedom over here and then I'm facing against all free, uh, strike freedom over there. So this should be quite interesting. I'm going to be doing type disadvantage throughout the match. So not going to be the best i would have to say but you know what let me just actually hop in and see how we can do let me actually hop into not my melee version of it let me do let me just quickly swap out to a shooting base cooldown reduction build and this should be sufficient enough so let me just actually do this as well you know um change it to this one over here so that's where we have that's the right one okay so now let me actually hop in. let me let me check all the parts here first let me see if i have everything correct yeah all right, this looks good. So, all right, let me hop in now for any further ado, right? I think, I don't know, like, hopefully my Kuda with Dutch build can kind of output some good damage, I would have to say. I don't know. We'll see. All right, we are in right now. So, let's see how hard they can be. Or right, I don't think this is that bad, right? Uh, we're able to do that much damage on a on, a, on that Vulcan, so it shouldn't be too, yeah. It's not that bad, but, um, I don't know. Like, if I get hit, I may take a lot of damage, potentially. So just purely gonna be using all these ESQ here. <laughs> Look at that. 
Is it basically targeting the head, both the arms, and then the legs? Is that is that what I'm seeing right there? Okay, so you can. Ooh, no, you don't. Let me that could be my possible. Yes, countering that. Nice. Got that. Can't can't touch this man. All right, moving on to the next move right now. Right? Yep. Yeah, I can just cut a normal attack as well, and that is sufficient enough. Let me melee then. No, 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 no. Oh! Whoa, hello? Oh, got my end in time, so I don't want to take the chances. I might get obliterated on the spot, so that's why. Yeah, all of them are on some CD reduction, so yeah. I'm, I'm like targeting the head, the legs, and all that. Ooh! We get the, the torso cannon as well, so okay. Glad I didn't get hit by that. Okay, what's the other one? Alright, final boss over here, so... Let me see what's the combat power looking like. Oh, wow! That is beefy right there. Yeah, that looks real beefy. Can we do... Is this one the bot one? Yeah, that's the bot one. I fail? Huh? Oh, it's time attack! That's why! I was like, what, what am I doing? Oh, I yeah. I was using too many EX skills, so I should be doing some normal attacks, so... Alright, now we kind of know how to play this, so let me actually come back around, like this time actually for real. Maybe use one or two EX skills, and then probably do a little bit more of like a normal shooting, I guess. Uh, I think that was kind of my bad on that part. Uh, using way too many custom EX skills, right? So let me, let me come back around and see if we can uh, potentially beat it. Alright, I'm back again once, once more, so I'm gonna start right at the back getting some buffers in already. Uh, but do I wonder? Like, I do want to know what do you ask me about having this full burst one here? Like, is this something like a lot of people or like or like a big fan of when they like initially see like the actual freedom? Like, I, I mean, like talk about it back in animation, like when this is actually in the anime. Like, how do you guys feel having it actually in game right now? Like, is this something you guys like and all that? I just want to know that. If you guys can let me know. All right, I'm just gonna use mine right now so I don't get hit. Yeah, timer is not on my side right now. Okay. Why is the time shorter? I feel like the time is shorter. Okay. Gonna do a little bit more of these right here. So yeah, I'm probably gonna, only gonna use my one they are using it. So I don't I don't wanna to potentially lose a lot of time right there. Yeah, that's good. Okay. No, no, you don't. Gotta use this again. So 14 seconds left, so I think I should be moving on towards the last phase right, right now, right? I'm surprised it took that long, like why? Oh yeah, last phase already, so I don't know, I think I'm still short on time. Yeah, I'm definitely still short on time. Let me, let me see if I can at least kill the big boss right here. Is this the big boss? Yeah, that is the big boss, but timer is up on my end already, is it? Is it up already? Is zero already, so maybe now. Yeah, I think I'm still short on time. I, I just couldn't make it uh, because I wasn't outputting enough damage. But you know, uh, we were able to test out, you know, multiple, not really multiple scenario, just, you know, kind of executing a lot uh, in terms of the full burst mode. But I do want to know, like, what do you guys feel about the full burst mode EX skill? Was that something you guys like uh, from the set when they released this in terms of the different attribute? Uh, I just want to know that in the comment section below if you guys would t tell me, right? So, with that being said, that should be pretty much it for this video right here, and then I'll catch you guys all on the next one.